Hey, bro. What? Oh, my God! Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver version of Randomizer Nuzlocke. Today, Fast is in the front, and as you earlier already saw, we encountered a shiny Feraligator. So, let me just show him. Chomp is what we nicknamed him. Now, the thing with the shinies are, they're super rare and hard to come by. So, what I'm going to do for this guy is allow him just to be on our team. But unfortunately, I I have to say this, Oscar and Lyria died. So I'll show you a montage and then yeah, I'll get ahead with this video. Okay, so let's just, after this little mo as you saw through the montage, we, oh, uh, the lap, whatever, a disc. Anyways, as I was saying, through that the montage, yeah, we didn't really get to see them, so if you guys want to know how they die, actually, I'll just tell you. Oscar died from a razor wind spawned by an Infernape, which I only found like once or twice, but yeah, pretty rare. Man. But, my strongest member is the Deoxys. Okay, let's just run. Come on! Eggbomb won't do that much, right? Yeah. So, let's just... Oh, get the busy... Octobuz... Octazooka. Get out of here, muck. Land, we're level 9. Where it is. Jump kick. Ah, uh, no. We're more of a special attacker anyways. And, oh, come on. God damn it. Okay. So. What do you guys think? Should we be allowed to use the Feraligator? Personally, in my opinion, I say yes. Let's just pick up this item. A power weight. 
power weights, if I remember correctly, because I do a lot of competitive battling on, like, Pokemon Sun, Moon, Alpha Sapphire, Omega Ruby, and X. I don't have Y. But anyways, that reduces your speed and, and increases your health, I believe. And here's Dr. Pokemon's house, I believe. Yep. So let's just go into his house. Professor Oak? What are you doing here? Okay. So, what is it? One, two... And you must be very careful. An egg! In the normal games, because I, this was the first game I played, like, Hard Gold, but I'm playing the other one. Um, oh, thank you! Um, the first one I got was... Uh, um, Togepi was the Pokemon I found in the egg, so I don't know what's in this egg. Are there Pokemon? Yep, I'm helping. Now, I know Pokemon, uh, like, the thing is, I don't know how to say this, but I know I got cheap for, um, Pokeballs and stuff, but that's only because, like, I really want to, like, I catch Pokemon in the beginning episode, so... Yeah. Okay, let's just head, out, head on out. Oh, Professor Elm? What's happening? That's very vague. Not much to go on. And you... Or... Wait, what's... I think it's the rival battle. Shoot! Right now, Mike, I don't have the time. Thank you. Okay. But you know what? I'm allowing for Alligator. I'm going to let Chomp be part of our team. And oh, man, a shiny for Alligator behind us looks awesome. Okay. I'll show you its moveset after. So let's just head on back to the city. And, wait, what? Here he is. You got Pokemon on waste? I don't have water waste. That Pokemon looks way too good for you, for a woman like you. You don't get what I'm saying? Well, I do have a great Pokemon. I show you what I mean. Oh, yeah? Random kid? Okay, Passerby Marlin. Level 6 Weedle. Yeah, I'm not... Not taking that. Who has fire moves? Okay, you have fire punch? What do you have? Ember. Oh yeah, during training, he got Ember. But I think I'll just go to Bax, because he can do any... He can really take down this Weedle. And why does he cross chop? Yeah, I don't do anything. Yeah. Fire punch. That shit actually one shot, right? No! Oh! Hmm. Also, literally, now it's spring, well, winter break, so it's pretty cool. So, to celebrate, I got myself a cup of joe from Tim, Tim, Timmy's. If you guys don't know what Timmy's is, it's basically Tim Hortons. But, really? God damn, it's good. Do you know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Yo, bro, be nice. Come on. Don't be like that. Give me that. That's my trainer card. Oh, no, you saw my name. His name was like Marlon, I think it was. Whatever. Let's just head on out. But literally, I don't have time to encounter any Pokemon. Okay. So, let's just finish up. Okay, almost there. So, let's see what's heading on. Okay. Who are you? We are investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Romeo, Romeo, and then welcome back to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it. I saw a dirty red haired boy looking into the building. 
What? You banned a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you get his name? Okay, the boy's name? Now, I said Marlin in it, but I forgot how to spell Marlin. My, an enemy of mine has returned. His name is Jacob. So, Jacob was his name? Yes. Thanks for all my investigation. Okay. Okay, so that was pretty weird. <sighs> yes, I know it's an egg. Uh, later, profess, sir. So let's just talk to mom and then I'll just end the episode. Actually, no, I'll do some grinding and I'll meet you back at the place. <gasps> yes, save my money. So I'm going to allow Farragir to be part of our team. So guys, I'll meet you back in a uh, new city. So I was just running in ahead and Laura and her Meryl are just playing. Oh, this is the catching tutorial. Okay. Let's see what our Pokemon is. It's like that, huh? It's too fast. Okay, what's she going to fight? She's going to fight a... Spiro. <laughs> That's funny. And she has a... A Starmie? What the hell? What move does it have? Rapid spin, jump kick, spatial rent? I did nothing. Click. 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 Oh. Dos. Break out. No. <gasps> the sparrow was caught. Just two men are evolved into a sparrow. Excuse me. Good job. I like Chomp. You guys don't know, Faragator is my favorite Pokemon, so bumping into one is really good. But I'll make sure to... But just a rule I found out on the internet. It's called, basically, the Dupe Claws rule. So if you find the same Pokemon that you found or the same family Pokemon, then you can run away. So you guys saying that's a lot for me? Let me know and I'll do that. Okay, so this guy doesn't have any moves. So let's go for Fire Blast. Oh yeah. You're dead. What? Why? I do nothing. Yeah. Uh, let's finish off with the Air Cutter. Dead. Good job, Chomp. And, like, another rule I found out was, um, basically, when a Pokemon, like, if you find a revive, you're allowed to use it to revive a dead Pokemon. So, but I think we'll save our reserves until we need them at the Pokemon League. Or whenever there's a really good Pokemon I want to catch. Ah. <sighs> This guy might actually have a thunder move. So let's just run. Yeah. Let's go. Come on. Run, bro. Up. Okay, hopefully we don't bump into a Pokemon. Thank you. I think now we're actually able to battle trainers. Oh, for the love of... Oh my god! Agron! This is a scary fight. But two battle tanks. One shiny, one non shiny. Karate chop! Take that! That did nothing. Dragon Pulse. Uh, that's times four effective. 
two more hits. Oh, what does more? Oh, oh my god! I didn't mean to do that! Yeah, I did not. Ooh! Okay, Fragger, don't you dare die. <gasps> nope. Beg. Let's heal. I did not mean to misclick that. Okay. Yeah, I would have died straight there. How much damage is that going to do? Pokemon. Summer again. Check moves. What does this do? 30? 65? Okay, yeah. Fire Blast is the best move. And it's... Agron is not known to be especially defensive, so this should actually kill. Okay, please let us go. Okay, come on. Fire Blast. <gasps> no! Tank it. Pokemon. But no. Deoxys. I do nothing. Ah, uh, thank God, Ember. Oh my God, that was scary. Yeah. Let's heal up. Oh my God, that was scary. Actually, I just remembered. He has Brave Bird. Who can learn it? Oh, seven five damage? They're all able to learn it. Bax no, Deoxys no, what about for alligator? Let's see if he's a special attacker. He's a special attacker, not a physical? Oh! That sucks. Okay, let's just keep that in our party. And okay. Okay. I'm not really interested in finding a, finding a Deoxys right now. We'll do some grinding off screen. Okay. I look weak? Bro, I have a Deoxys? What do you have? A Roselia. Level 5. Okay, so I should be able to tank any move that's going to throw me, so let's go for Fire Blast. Thunder Punch. Oh god, oh god. 8 damage. Okay. Okay, Burn. No. Bax, we need you. Thunder Punch. Yeah, that won't do anything. Fire pop. Dead. It's a shame that our Aunt Pharos died. Because she would have been so much u more useful. X Scissor! Is it good? 70? Okay. See you, Maya. No. Okay, what do you have, bro? Okay. Steelix. Oh, level two. So. Fire Blast. I actually should kill. Because it's level two or level six. Did you a chomp? And if you guys don't like me using chomp, I'm sorry. Steelix? Again? <gasps> Level 5. Fire Blast. Take this and die. Oh. Pursuit. That won't do anything. You're dead. 
Hasta la vista. Ok. Two hundred and ten. That's pretty good. Awesome. Brave. Br <laughs> That's actually funny. <laughs> I can't believe I'm also a brave bird. You're the TM. I can learn it. <laughs> That's funny. I'm sorry, but that is funny. Okay. So guys, my thing's about to die, so I'll just. Come back with you when we are actually ready. Okay, so we are back. I know that guy's a boat catcher, but I'm not in the mood for battling him. Okay, quickly, no, no fights, no fights. Yes! <gasps> Wait, is this a new, is this a new cave? Dark cave. We can't get into a counter. Okay, what's our encounter for this area? Oh! Guys, can you see that? I can see more of the cave. Okay, this is our encounter. What is it? Frothlass. Okay. Okay, I don't want to risk pressure. Okay. Hmm. Level ball. No, let's go for a quick ball because quick balls in the first turn can easily catch a Pokemon. Okay. One. Two, three, yes! Awesome, we got a ghost ice type. Sweet! That's awesome, guys. Okay, the Snowland Pokemon. Legends in a snowy region and say that a woman who was lost in an icy mountain was reborn as Frostlass. Oh, that's interesting. Since so we got a girl. Because, like, <gasps> I'm frozen. Yeah? So let's just check out Elsa. It's in the nature. Oh my god, this is so good. Okay. Yes. One really good move for its nature. Good defense. A horrible special defense. Okay, yeah, let's see what this item is, a safari ball, okay, uh, oh, let's get this item, the yellow flute, I don't think we'll ever need that, but we've, I don't think that we're able to catch a Pokemon here, so unfortunately we can't catch one, okay, so let's just, Oh, how do we, how do we do? Oh, okay. I can take that. Okay, bye. Well, guys, we made it to Violet Town. But if there's one thing I know, you can actually trade a Pokemon here for another Pokemon. No, it's a battle spell for an Onyx. But let's see what Pokemon this guy wanted to trade us for. Oh, it's this kid right here. Do you have a bounce back? Ah, uh, well, partially we don't won't have time for that. But, next time guys, we're gonna head on out to basically in that spot right there. Where well, normally it's a bunch of Bell spells and stuff that you have to fight. So we will not know what's happening next time. And then after that, we will fight Faulkner, the elegant master of flying Pokemon. But we can catch one more Pokemon. Or a few more. So let's just do that. Route 32. Let's just look for a Pokemon. Here's an exit counter, guys. And then it's a Marowak. Nice. I think I'll go for another quick ball. Click. One, two, three. Nice. 
That's what I'm talking about. Bone Keeper Pokemon. It's basically the evolution of Cubone, which I believe is the baby baby Pokemon from Kangaskhan. I'm not 100% sure, but there's a lot of conspiracies. So this guy... Um... Ed. I'll just call him Ed. So let's just head on into the final spot, and then we'll catch our final Pokemon. So here we can find basically... Yeah, so what you gotta do is if you're following me on my footsteps, go here, here, and inside here. Okay. No. Okay. Okay, so So we talked to this one professor. Unknown. So let's just get quick quick try to get some coffee. Our final encounter of the day is what is it going to be? Okay, here it is, guys. It is a electric. I like it. Okay, I can take that. So, our final quick ball and our final encounter. One, two, three, click. Yep, electric was caught. Nice. The electric Pokemon, so we have an electric type now, which is pretty cool. Only want people that get this reference from Dynasty King will know what I'm talking about. Max. So that's a decent encounter. And, well, that. Well, then, guys. I'm your host, Tears My 56. And now, there's only. As you guys know, I do dinosaur shoutouts, but no one's been leaving comments about saying what type of dinosaur they want to be, so how am I supposed to help you guys out? So, in the next episode, as you already know, we'll be taking on a Bellsprout challenge. And, I'm your host, my 56 and I'll tell you next time. Like this video, comment, comment what dinosaurs you are, and the question of the day, and keep on mining. <laughs>